stay abroad and make cassava fufu called water fufu in Cameroon. Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today, I am going to show you how to make water fufu or cassava fufu. Don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. To make water fufu, what we need is cassava, a knife, sponge, and a big bucket like this, depending if you are making it on a large scale. The first thing you have to do is to cut, peel, and wash your cassava. So after peeling my cassava, I start washing. I have to wash them so well and put them in this container full of water. Make sure you wash your cassava very well so that you have white and clean fufu. my washed cassava I'm going to leave it in this bucket for three days for them to get soft and for fermentation to take place and on the third day I'm going to grate the soft fermented cassava as you can see our cassava has fermented and it is 90% soft so now I will have to grate the cassava. I have to grate all of it using this grater. Actually, back home, you'll have to use a machine. But I don't have that machine here in China. So I'll try to use this small grater to grate. This is my already grated cassava, so I'll have to clean this bucket, throw the water in this bucket, clean the bucket, transfer the grated cassava into the bucket, put in more clean water for the cassava to be 100% soft and fermented again. the fourth day my cassava is 100% soft and well fermented what I need to do now is to use this strainer to strain the cassava after straining I'll put in this bag for it to drain
fine cassava paste is ready for straining. I'll put it in this bag and I'll take it out there for it to strain. My fufu has been out here for more than 24 hours and I think it is well drained. It's time for us to check if the fufu is ready. So as you can see, I have my fufu ready for consumption. So this is my fufu or cassava dough. So you can use it to make fufu. Don't forget to give a thumbs up, subscribe, share, and hit the notification button. Subscribe.